And here's some breaking news coming in. Parents of students studying in APJ school are staging a protest in front of the school premises in Noida. Now, 1,000 parents are up in arms over the school fee hike and have decided not to send their wards to school. The parents also allege that the school has been arbitrarily increasing the fees and not following the Uttar Pradesh fee ordinance. Previously, the parents have raised concerns about similar issues, but they allege no action have been taken by the school authority so far. Apurva Sridhar joining us live. Apurva, so yet again the issue of arbitrary fee hike. Another school, another location. This time it's APJ school in Noida, which is quite a reputed school of this area. Tell us what exactly are the parents alleging? We are currently outside the APJ school in sector 16 Noida. As you can see, all these parents have gathered here with one big concern of how the APJ school has been allegedly hiking free arbitrarily. The fact that they have been consistently asking the management to roll back the fees but there hasn't been any respite. Let's talk to all these parents to find out now, uh, to show concern and to un uh, show the uh, school that this is a big concern. A lot of parents did not send their kids to school as a mark of protest. I have joined by one of the parents Niharika whose child studies in class 7th. Ma'am, tell us what has been the big concern, your child studies in class 7th, to what extent have the school fees been high? See, uh, from 12 years it has almost increased to 100% plus. When my son was in nursery I was paying 12,000 and now uh, he is in 6th and we are paying 29,000 plus. So again, it is 100% plus hike in just seven years. So uh, same goes with KGE, right now, KG section. KG section is these days paying the highest fee. By the time they reach seven, eight uh, class, they would be paying 70,000 or maybe one lakh. So again, overall, one concern is fee hike. And the other concern is definitely the student-child ratio. In my class, my son's class itself, uh, the uh, students and the uh, place overall, the uh, complete desks and all, it's so much cluttered that even the entrance is covered by the uh, desk and the chair. So if a student is sitting on a desk and a chair which is on the entrance, how do you expect that student to actually concentrate and uh, uh, study in the class? So this year, as all of you are saying, there has been a consistent yeah. increase yeah. in the fee. To what extent has this academic session, how much have they increased so this if, year? If you just uh, check around the overall uh, percentage, it it's goes more than around 20%. Okay. So probably it will be, if you calculate the, the every, every breakup, that will cost around 30% of hike in that fees. So which as, as per ordinance, which UP government says is more is almost 8 to 9%, yeah. which again into a tuition fee. But they have increase in transport, tuition, I think electric charges and everything they have moved, which goes to 30%. And uh, uh, we did a protest, uh, I think, uh, almost 15 days back. So the the management have called some parents so i was also involved i was also went there okay. so they didn't uh, they didn't give any explanation we did ask uh, how much you know what's the breakup and all that but they didn't give any explanation okay. they just simply said and i believe uh, i was a bit late so few parents told me that the, even they were indirectly told that it's your choice you want to put your uh, kid here and it's your choice we will not be doing that so most of the parents have been asked to either take away the kids or yeah. pay the hike fee most of the parents ma'am as you also said uh, there's a certain or the ordinance where clearly says that you're supposed to pay for only the facilities that you avail. Yes. Has that been the case? Are you no, paying no, for the facilities no, 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 that your child is availing? Not a single facility. Even in the, even in the, in the classroom, there are only three fans. Okay. Can you imagine? The, the children are getting totally persuaded every day. They're coming very tired because there is no fan even. Only three fans that they're giving. So how the facility, other facilities they are going to give? They even don't think about the, uh, you know, uh, whether uh, uh, the child is getting, uh, you know, stressed by the temperature. Anything they don't even think. So how the other facilities they are going to give? Sir, also as you spoke about the fact that uh, you were being asked to pay for lawn tennis for nursery and class one and class two, and you feel that this is absolutely unnecessary that you've been asked to force to pay for that fees as well. Yeah, there are. Uh, this is one of the charges, and there are many charges like I mentioned earlier. Like uh, now, for last two years, uh, they have come up with an agency called Veledra, which is uh, supposed to be the promoted by the APJ group only. Okay. And they are saying that this agency will conduct classes 
uh, from calligraphy to uh, Vedic mathematics and different astronomy, robotics and a whole host of classes it will chess, it will uh, conduct in the and that too they are conducting in the school time. That is the biggest flout they are making of the rules uh, set by CBSC and state government that they are conducting those classes within the school hours and forcing the kids to attend those classes. Okay. First year they sort of made it uh, not so mandatory that these classes are going on, these are hobby classes, these are extra interest classes you may take. But and all in all there has been at least a 20% increase, arbitrary increase in the school fees and that has been Afrida. The big yes. concern that all these parents have had, they've all hmm. gathered outside the APJ school in sector 16 protesting right. about how they've been arbitrarily increasing the school fees and not right. following any of the so guidelines. So there are a lot of arm twisting in UP, tactics UP, uh, in that tactics. sense Apurva from what we just heard. Either pay up or withdraw your child and this will not do because this is serious matter and the state education department must take a note of it. Thanks for joining us, Apurva.